Okay, if I'm reading these schematics right, the only way we're going to sort this out is by doing a complete master reset. As you might expect, there's a number of steps involved. As always. I'm going to need your help here. Okay, you should be seeing a keypad up there. <laughs> In order to start the reset process, you'll need a specific command code. Try... 0915? Stand by. Confirmed. Code accepted. The system is requesting I use a slider to confirm. It is, however, locked. Alright, I can unlock it, but this step requires a bit of coordination. I'll need to disconnect the circuit at the same time you confirm the reset. On the count of three? Yes, on three. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm ready. I'll unlock it. One, two, three. Uh, so, how'd that work out? I'm detecting an increased amount of hydrocarbon particles in our vicinity. Is something burning? Oh, shit. Shit. Ow, that's hot. <laughs> okay, so we're going to need another power coupling. Should be a replacement kicking around here somewhere. Think you could track it down for me? Any idea where to start? I'm sure there's a spare power coupling hanging around close by. You know where it is. Well, go on then. I'm on it. Minga. There we go. Here you are. Thanks, Jack. Just give me a sec. Coupling installed. Give me some good news. Sorry, Captain. I'm afraid it's a lost cause. Huh? <laughs> I think she was talking to me. I was just saving you the trouble. I'm getting older down here. It looks like it worked. The hollow table is more or less online. More or less. The image is somewhat distorted. Well, that won't do. Hang on. How's that? Better? Mm. Yes, that rectified it. Chiron Station Network Access Client. Habitat Alpha Online. Mainframe connection established. Synchronizing control devices. Liv, you're beeping. Personal user interface synchronized. I can read this. Wow. All right, let's see what we can dig up. Here we are, Habitat A. Those icons. That must be us. I was right. We're the only ones here. Yes. Well, this has all been terribly enlightening. Shall we move on? Okay. So there's no one else in the hab. What about the rest of the station? This is everything. Affirmative. This image represents all of Chiron Station. Right. Let's see who else is on board. Jack, you mind taking a look at the map while I keep searching on here? Of course. We've got some questions that need answering. We are not receiving any signal from the other habitat. That's not a good sign. If there was anyone left, the other habitat would be where I'd expect to find them. The station's generator is deserted as well. You see that readout? Running a little hot, wouldn't you say? Indeed. 
That would explain the power fluctuations we've been experiencing. Hmm. Pretty good bet. Every branch of the station connects to this structure here, the transit hub. Still no signs of any crew, or anyone at all, really. Not showing any occupants in the research wing either. This part of the facility appears to be under construction. You think there'd be someone around then? No reading. That's odd. There's no one. The station's deserted. According to this, we're alone. Juno, what the hell? Where's the crew? Technically, I never said there was a crew on this station. So we're alone here? I didn't say that either. Oh, forget it! I'm not going round in circles with you again. There's got to be something else. Captain Rose. Juno, unless you're about to explain to me exactly what the hell is going on, I would keep quiet. <laughs> Hang on. I think I might have hit upon something here. Looks like a priority message on a loop. Priority alert. Containment protocols breached. Multiple branch sectors compromised. General evacuation order has been issued. Oh dear. Evacuation order? Proceed immediately to your designated lifeboats. Message will repeat in one minute. All right, Juno. Start talking. Captain Rhodes, I assure you, there is no need for concern. <laughs> really? Uh-oh. Uh-oh? What do you mean, uh-oh? I think we need to evacuate. <gasps> what was that? That was an electrical malfunction. You mean one of those electrical malfunctions you told us not to worry about? No. Okay. Yes, but <laughs> this is different. Different how? That last energy spike overloaded one of our substations. The house power grid is collapsing. How do we stop it? We can't. At least not from here. So we're just supposed to sit here and do nothing? Juno. All right, listen carefully. I may only have a few moments before we lose contact. Jack, I'm unlocking your reactive cutter. There's an emergency release on the door leading out of here. You can use your cutter to gain access. You still have some time before the hab becomes unsafe. Make your way to the terminal. There should be a tram there that will take you to the... Juno? Juno, acknowledge. We've lost contact. You know, I always thought I'd enjoy this moment a bit more. Perhaps we should... Get the hell out of here. Yeah. Still a lot of questions that need answering, and sticking around here is not going to help us. Plus life support is failing. Uh, yeah, plus that. This must be the emergency release here. Behind this panel on the door. I'll take a look. Where's my cutter? I should be able to cut through the bolts that secure the panel. One. Two. Are we gonna count? Three. Four. Nice! That did it! Here, help me pull it open. You take that side. Oh wow. Jack, hold on. Before we go out there... Listen, that shell you're in now, that's the only one of you there is. Oh. If something happens to you out there, if you get shut down, that's it. Huh. You're gone. Well, that's new. <laughs> what about you? Yeah, the same thing. Without an EVA suit, you're considerably more vulnerable than I am. Sure, but I'm used to it. It's not really something you've ever had to think about before. You'll be fine. Just try and remember what I said, okay? All right, Liv. 
So we have to play it safe this time around. Well, here we go. I think I have still flashlight. At least emergency lighting still seems to be active. Well, I don't think so. I think I can take off this HUD. Hey, stop it. Power's still up in this area. I doubt that will last. We should keep moving. Sign above the door says to tram. That's where we're headed. Well, it's blocked, obviously. Whoever built this place. Initializing scan. Initializing interview. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm okay. I mean, that did just probably shave a couple of years of my lifespan, but... <laughs> Let's hope not. What the hell was that? Most likely some form of security measure. Well, it must not work too well if we're tripping it on the way out. It doesn't appear to be working at all anymore. Doors sealed. We must have triggered some kind of lockdown procedure. Not seeing any sort of emergency release or access panel. You'd expect there'd be some sort of override or... Liv, up here, there's a control room. Let's see. If there is a way to get the door open, I expect that is where we'll find it. Yes, now we just have to find a way inside. But how? All the doors are locked. Mm -hmm. Yes, exactly. This... this damn contraption. Containment protocol. Please proceed to the infirmary for further instructions. Oh. How convenient is that? Yeah, let's check it out. It seems like a surgical table. An infirmary, right next to security. Yeah, strange. You know, this place looks... familiar. Let's have a look around. Huh. Why have medical beds in such close proximity to security and the habitat? It could be... a few of the occupants were immunocompromised. Perhaps. Anyway, keep looking. We need to find a way into that control room. This control panel appears to be sealed. Though what it actually controls, I'm not sure. Only one way to find out. Well, only one quick way. Cut the panel off. Exactly. I think I may have just gotten access to the maintenance docks. Nice find. But the controls are faulty. The access way won't stay open long enough for me to get inside. Scoot over. Maybe I can hold it open for you. So come. <laughs> Didn't see much light up there, by the way. I assume my headlamp still works? Right. Should do. Just press the switch on either side of your head. Headlamp checks out. Good to go. Right. I'll hold open the hatch. You head up into the ducts. Ready? Mm hmm? Ready. There. It's open. Head on up. Oh, popcorn's coming with me. What do you see? Very little. I suspect these ducts have not been accessed in quite some time. See if you can find a path to the control room. <laughs> I think we may be coming up on the control room. Stand by. 
there's some grating blocking access to the control room. I might be able to cut through. Do it. Not like anyone's gonna notice. Jack, over here. See anything resembling door controls up there? Give me a moment to investigate. There is a keypad here, but I don't know the access code. Do you think there could be any chance someone's gone and left it written down somewhere nearby? I would sincerely doubt it. Do people really do that? Happens a lot more often than you might think. <laughs> that is grossly negligent. <laughs> I wouldn't say grossly. You've done it before, haven't you? Look, we're burning oxygen here. Go on, let's see what else you can find. There's an emergency override switch embedded into the console here. It's not immediately clear how to access it. You'd think they'd want the emergency override to be easily accessible. In case of, you know, emergencies. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that's what our keypad unlocks. This appears to be some sort of recharge station, similar to the induction panels on the Kronos. Hmm, well, add it to the list of things that might be useful. Keep looking. There has to be a way to get these doors open. What about this drone? I think it's seen better days. It lacks power. Okay, well, let's see if our induction charger can revive him. Stand by. <laughs> That's a convenient shape. Recharging. You're thinking it might have the passcode? The unit's drive data might still be salvageable. Without your scanner, you'll need popcorn to extract the data. Popcorn, you can help him out there, yeah? Seems he might have hit upon something. I think he just passed an objective to my arm computer. A bit oh. bossy, aren't you? Popcorn has passed me the security code. One, four, five, one. Override unlocked. That did it. Security's lifted. Yay. Come on out of there. I'll meet you in the next corridor. On our way. Come on, popcorn. Let's go. <laughs> Great, well done in there. Yes, yes, you too.